so hey you guys and welcome back to my channel today i am going to be going over my candle collection i was supposed to have this video done a very long time ago but just things happened during the fall that you got i'm sure you guys remember with the whole storm and evacuating and everything and i never got the videos done so today my plan is to get this video done to share all of my amazing candles with you guys so let's go ahead and jump right into the video so the first candle that i have absolutely been loving is the dw i believe it's called juniper wreath it smells so good it has this really nice almost jolly rancher smell to it it just smells so nice it is a three wick candle so the candle has approximately 26 hours of burning time i don't know why but i find that these burn a whole lot better what i like to do is before i even burn the candle i like to take the wick and just cut it in half i just feel like you, you get more um you start smelling the candle a lot faster. The second tip is when I'm done burning the candle, I like to take a Q-tip or tweezers or whatever's around me at the time and I dip the wick into the wax and that just kind of cuts out a lot of that smoke smell because I mean the worst thing that could possibly happen is you burn a candle, it smells really good and now it smells like smoke because you you know blew it out but juniper wreath is amazing so the next one is another dw candle this one here is called milk and cookies now i like the candle so much that i went on ahead and i picked up two of these so i have two of the milk and cookies and it is just amazing this one here is called lavender chamomile from dw home and this just smells so good you know growing up i can tell you now i never really liked um or enjoyed lavender but now anything that's going to be relaxing or calming like i'm all about it now and i'm really really loving that the next one that i have is called tranquil lotus and this smells oh really nice soft and relaxing so good it almost smells like a bath soap or something it smells really really nice and just like this is something that i would burn like all year round and i am going to burn it all year round ugh, it smells like pure vanilla it smells really really good almost like vanilla extract but just a little bit sweeter like if someone made like vanilla cake or something it smells so so good i absolutely love this so this one here was ten dollars it's called jasmine iris and it smells so nice and tranquil and soft definitely bath time but it smells really really nice and it's called jasmine iris so jumping right into the bath and body works candles and these are it right here and they just smell so good so so good i am so excited this one here is called salted caramel and oh <laughs> oh if it was a cookie, there would be no more left because I would eat it all because it just smells so good. Mm. I mean, most of these candles, I fell in love with them so much that I got to. <laughs> I was just like, oh, so entranced with these candles at the store. Between Bath & Body Works and DW, the only thing that I noticed to be a difference between the two candle companies is Bath & Body Works, I can take the lid off have it standing free without burning it and the smell will just kind of perfume the bathroom the hallway and it smells really really good but dw i don't get that same fragrance you have to burn it in order to get the scent out of it so i think that's something that you guys might want to know if you're interested in just seeing the difference but nevertheless you can't beat 7.99 with dw at all oh oh so this one here is black cherry merlot so i'm about to say something and this can make you love or hate this fragrance i opened this and i smelled it the first thing that came to mind was the black of the berry the sweet of the juice and you can smell the black cherries in this thing you can smell it it's super super strong the fra okay so it has black cherry black raspberries and sumptuous merlot this here is amazing amazing i mean it's just really really nice but i love the smell so much <laughs> you're gonna be like nadia you're not playing nope i'm not this is how much this thing was just so gorgeous yep there's one more <laughs> So yes, I picked up four of these candles because I was just like, OMG, this thing smells so good. Like there was no way I couldn't get it. And I think I'm probably going to end up getting some more. I can see this being part of my 
my regular buy from Bath and Body Works because it just smells so good. Like you just can't. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Really quickly, the salted caramel it has salted caramel, roasted chestnuts, caramelized sugar, and spice rum. And when I tell you this one smells really good. Oh, if you ever had Pepper's Farms caramel, it's called a caramel something. It's got chunks of macadamia nut. It has um, caramel chunks. <laughs> it just makes me really hungry smelling it. But um, yeah, this is really good. Oh, and again, I love the fact that they put this thing in these little cartons here. It just makes it so easy to store. So moving right along to the next tray of candles. This one here is Vanilla Spice Pear. Oh, just really nice. These candles smell so, so good. It has um, pear, white rum, creamy vanilla, fresh cinnamon. Really, really nice. I do have two of those also. This one here is called Frosted Cranberry. I did get two of the Frosted Cranberries. It just smells really, really nice. Mm, again, very similar to that Black Cherry Merlot. This one has iced cranberries, blonde wood, red apples, and tonka bean. It smells really, really good. Oh, it smells so good. It smells so, so good. The burning time on this one is 25 to 45 hours. Let me just say this frosted cranberry smells so, so, so good to the point where I even got the car fresheners. Unfortunately, I don't have them here. But downstairs, I purchased four. So the fragrance in the car fresheners is the um, frosted cranberry and I'm just like absolutely loving it. So moving right along to the next one. So in this tray, because they were having such a great sale, I went on ahead and I got some of the oils. Um, the original price says $6.50, but I know you can get five for something. I don't really remember, but I think they went as low as $2 a piece. So I was just like, let me just get it. So the fragrance that I got was lemon cello. And then my friend came to visit and she got me some. Oh, no, here's the air fresheners right here. So I, I got four. One's in the car. Okay. That's all. Okay. So I have cinnamon swirl. Frosted Cranberry and then Winter Candy Apple. So my friend came to visit and she got me some of the Lemon Cello. So there's six of the Lemon Cello here. There's another six Lemon Cello in this one because I bought this, she gave me this. And then Frosted Cranberry. I actually have about 12 of those. Um, six are here and then six around the house downstairs, okay? So moving to the candle. I love you. This is gonna go in the massive bedroom. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it in here now. When the video is over, oh, it's so good. Oh. It smells so, so good. I can't wait to burn this tonight. So this one has cactus flower petals, sun-kissed coconut, and sparkling lemon. I don't know what it is recently that I have just been attracted to anything with lemon in it. Lemon cello, the I love you. Um, the perfume Chanel Le Mille Cinq Low, like that one has a little bit of citrusy in it. It is just really clean, fresh, refined, soft, elegant. It's just something about it that is just like so refreshing to me. It almost it's almost like a, a burst of sunlight when it has the lemon in it. It just kind of wakes up your palate and you just kind of get the aroma going. And it's just so nice. If you have never tried anything with lemon in it, please try it because it's almost like going to bed and having waking up to someone making you breakfast in bed it's just that nice i don't know i feel like i'm getting older and lemon and lavender are like my two things now and um what is it omg i'm trying to remember even my essential oil i do lavender and lemon something lemon zest lemon it just smells so good together with my little oil diffuser i really do love it but if you if you haven't tried it, just try it and then you can let me know if you like it. And if you tried it and you don't like it, that's fine too. But I think I don't think you guys are not gonna like it because everything that I've told you thus far, you guys have been liking it. So um lemongrass. Maybe it's lemongrass. I think it's lemongrass and lavender oil that I put together in the oil diffuser. I mean, I think that's what it is. So I ended up getting the lemongrass candle. This one has the essential oils, again, three wick. And I'm just telling you, there's something so crispy about that lemon that's coming through and just really nice and clean. And it's not strong like lemony or lime. 
it's just really nice i wonder what lemon and um, vanilla would smell like because that would be interesting oh it just smells so good and clean and you guys know that i do oh let me just show you really quickly before i get off topic i have two of them i'm sure by now you realize if i like something i'm just gonna get two of it um you guys know that i clean quite a bit and when i get done cleaning the house the oil diffuser or a candle going is like my go-to thing because that just lets me know the house is done and when you come in it just feels really nice and clean and airy and don't get me wrong i like all of the fragrance that i purchased it's just that lemon it's just amazing i love it i can't even say anything else about it so i got this guy here for free and inside is vanilla and there's three four there's six i think i got six all together because these were 50 or 60 percent off for the vanilla one so i think they were like a dollar something so i was like i'm, I'm getting them originally from six dollars um so this one here is vanilla I think I'm going to use this for the master bedroom because it is vanilla. It's nice, soft, sensual, just really nice and sweet. So I'm going to use that for in here. I have to get a couple of more of the burners, but I'm, I'm loving this. And the can, let me, just, let me just take one of these really quickly. I'll just take um, the evergreen and put it in here. Look at that. <gasps> just really nice and gorgeous. I love it. And it's. I guess it kind of goes with the fall theme, but then it can also be um, Christmas or it can be year round. I don't think there's anything like, you know, fancy about it. I got something really nice and simple, but I really do love this. The next item that I got for free was this guy right here. And again, I'll put my candle in here. So you just put it in here, you just burn it. One of the things that the salesperson did tell me is these little marble lids could be used as coasters. All you'd have to do is when you're done pop it off and take the elastic off and you can use it as coasters but my house doesn't really have marble in it so it wouldn't really benefit me but if you're interested you might want to try it um and then of course i got another one of these and this one here is the cranberry woods the smell is very similar to the frosted cranberry this one just has a little bit more of a woodsy um scent to it i got three for free with my purchase so all right so we are on our last batch of candles and pretty much it's the same scent just i got two um oh, the minute i took the lid off you can just smell it this one here is called mary mimosa and i got two it's just, it's just really really nice and clean i i really do love it. it smells like christmas um sparkling champagne red apple slices ice sugar crystals it just smells really really great i absolutely love it the next two eucalyptus mint again eucalyptus lavender lemon i'm just loving these things because it just smells so nice and clean i have two of these and this one is called eucalyptus mint oh you know what it smells like it almost smells like a dove and zest kind of had a baby mm, it smells really good so it has fresh eucalyptus sweet spearmint lemon peel and sage that's probably why i like it because the lemon in here but it's so clean and airy and really really nice i would definitely use this as a summer fragrance also just because of the scent so again i can see myself getting this this one is called cactus blossom the cactus blossom has cactus flower petal sunkissed coconut vanilla sparkling lemon now that i'm reading off the ingredients i'm realizing probably why i'm so addicted to these fragrances is because they do have coconut vanilla and lemon which are the three things that i absolutely love and i'm just realizing now that i'm reading it off but oh this is so nice and light i can see like i said i can see myself using this and having it year round really nice grapefruit gin fizz really really nice absolutely love it this one has red ruby grapefruit sparkling water and juniper so as i buy candles if you are interested in seeing what i purchased what i have definitely let me know and i'll still do some like maybe i'll do like a monthly favorites like what i bought what i'm loving what i'm liking and stuff like that um other than that i hope you guys really really enjoy i do have a giveaway so this right here is the dw rose it's called sparkling rose and there's three candles inside so i am going to give this to someone so i am just going to select someone at random and when i select you 
please feel free to give me your address so that way I can ship it off a ASAP. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Maybe this motivated you to start your own collection. I thought I had a lot of candles until I posted pictures on Instagram and I asked like, is this like ODN? And everybody was like, no girl, I got about 50. Somebody else said they had 60, somebody else said they had 30, somebody said they had 10. No one came back to me saying they didn't have any candles. So I'm thinking you guys probably love your home, your everything smelling really good just as much as I do. So I'm amongst friends. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you next time. Bye.